just one station with video you have to see. An angry customer throwing hair into the food at a local restaurant. Thanks for joining us on 19 News at 3. I'm Nicole Versansky. Well, now the police are involved. Now at 3, Winnie Dorch spoke with the manager who is getting threats. The owner and the manager did not want to show their faces on camera due to retaliation. However, they tell us exactly what happened that day. I thought it was disgusting. A hairy situation over at Chili Peppers Fresh Mexican Grill on East 185th Street. The woman in this video can be seen pulling strands of hair out of her head and then sprinkling it all over the food that's behind the glass. Nothing justifies that behavior and her going to that extreme. It was Saturday around four. The woman walked into the restaurant with her family. Employees said she was upset about the taco meat. So they're basically just doing a job, letting her know that the meat is extra and it started from there. Uh, she became verbally harassed to the girls, calling them out of their names. So she didn't want to pay for extra meat? I'm assuming she would have paid for it if they could have given it to her, but unfortunately it wasn't done cooking. So there was nothing that they could do for her. The red haired woman was asked to leave several times, but she stuck around a little bit longer, leaving her mark in the food. Employees forced to throw it all away. Definitely a big dent in their day. Over a thousand dollars worth of food and it will affect our business in the future because that's food costs that we've lost that we're going to have to replace, but we don't have that money to replace that. The Mexican Grill is a staple in the community, a place where you'll see repeat customers. This experience, nothing like they've seen before, hoping it never happens again. You can't come in and just continuously disrespect people and think that people are just supposed to tolerate that. If you don't like how we run the business, you could just simply eat somewhere else. The manager called police, but the woman in the video took off before they could get there. In Cleveland, Winnie Dorch, 19 News.